forbid nobody nobody on commentary um so I'm pretty sure oh yeah this is um winners finals so this is three out of five I'm assuming <coughs> this is game one uh, that's I mean you pretty much gotta guess that I really react to that there so all right good start off for uh, for chipmunk down getting Dawson in the corner oh that's yeah that was gonna say that's like minus five Getting Dawson into the corner is half the battle. Um, now you just kind of play from from a range here, but he kind of has to come to you now, so a little, little bit of advantage. It was a pretty good slide under the red fireball there, but he just kind of chips away at your life, and yeah, he has so many ways around fireballs and stuff, and now all of a sudden he just took, took the lead. Now he gets set up. Uh, but here, oh, uh, Chipmunk down playing B-Trigger 2. Yeah. It's hard. There's a lot of matches where, I mean, I play Akuma, so there's a lot of matches where it's like you could probably go either way. So it's more like what your your preference is or the way that you approach the game or the matchup or whatever. So, I mean, some of them are blatantly like you should play one or you should play two. But this one kind of feels like you could play either or. And for now, Chipmunk Down is going to stick with um, Beat Trigger 2. Uh, the um, forward fierce, the little ground pot drop, drop thing or whatever uh, that Akuma does, yeah, that has too much recovery on it. Um, you know, it got like what people said was a nerf because it used to be plus uh, plus one and now it's minus two, and it's like I, 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 I can see the nerf part of it. Like I get it. Like you can't just use it as brain dead pressure or whatever. But I didn't really think that there was too much that you could get off of it, anyways. You know what I mean? Like I know it kept you in on some characters or whatever, so I know it helps that, but. Uh, but now, like, they made it so that you can, like, before all you could get was a jab. Now you can get, like, like standard B&B &B that does so much damage. So I, I'd argue that it was it was a wash between those two there. <laughs> Maybe even a buff, but I uh, can't really use it to get in anymore. So And still in neutral here. Um, Chipmunk down still looking to find his way in. If he gets one touch, I mean, I was going to say, that's going to be most of his life for one touch there. And not looking good for Chipmunk down here so far. He's got to change whatever he's got to change. Looking to navigate. Oh, God. The fortress that are the limbs of uh, of Dalsim. And looking the same way again pretty much as these other ones have gone. Able to keep him out. Uh, oh, just activate. All right. So get him up there. Now you do become, you know... Yeah, you do become kind of scary. Like, like you don't want to get touched by Akuma when he's in that. I mean, any one singular touch by... Oh, that was really good. Any one singular touch can end up being 300 damage at, at any given moment, so... And this is totally... Totally doable. I mean, Akita just straight up giving up. He doesn't care. At this point, he's all in on defense. He does not care about his, his V-Trigger. And, ooh, this is kind of rough. Oh, wow. I didn't think that that was going to hit from there, but interesting. Uh, so 2-0. <clears throat> and we'll see what kind of uh, what kind of changes Chipmunk Down makes here. Are you out? Later, money. Uh, good job today. Thank you. Good shit, Thanks, man. <laughs> it's kind of rough. <laughs> so. So switching, he mentioned, uh, Chipmunk Down mentioned to me earlier that uh, he thinks that V-Trigger 1 is the way to go in this match. So bearing that in mind, I'm not sure why he played 2. I, I know I've seen it played both ways. Uh, 
I've seen Tokido mostly play V Trigger 2. Um, so maybe he just plays the match differently. I, I, I don't know. But I think uh, Chipmunk Down's probably, you know, a little bit more comfortable playing V Trigger 1 in this match. So uh, still trying to find uh, a consistent way in on Dalson. Oh, yeah. Probably the most annoying thing about him is the, the fireballs. But you gotta find some other ways around him other than jumping. You know, you can do hurricane kick. You can just dash up. Like if you think a fireball is coming, you know what I mean. Just move forward um, and get under the fireball. I mean, Akuma has some options because of his parry. So Dawson can't always just sit there and pressure you off of the fireball like that. Oh god, that was. I think that was an accident, but it worked out for Chipmunk down. Yes. Oh, he messed up the. Uh, that was an option select. He messed it up. Yeah, he tried it again. I guarantee you he'll be going into trading mode after this. Uh, because I totally forgot that you could do that. <clears throat> I totally forgot. Uh, still trying to find, again, a good way in. Oh. Yeah, I think he got two hits on that. I'm not really sure. Oh, my God. Yep. It is minus two, so not punish. <laughs> oh, God. Yep. All right. Uh, Ikita totally fine with taking the throw. I mean, hell, he's got two matches to work with here, so... He's just, he's blocking. He's basically told Chipmunk down, like, I will take a throw or two. Especially since the throws aren't as scary. Because they're really not. I, I mean, like, there's there's still ways to, you know, convert off them and, and have little bits of pressure, but not to the degree that it was, at least for Akuma. You know what I mean? So, um, I think Chipmunk down has to change his... Oh, it was really good. Don't do it. Yeah. Has to change his game a little bit. Oh, oh, I think he... I don't know what he tried there. I don't know what he tried there. I have no idea. Um, so he has to adjust his game. He's got to, you know, start throwing a little bit more, you know. And then the, the crappy part is, is that it kind of pushes you away. So kind of reset. Uh, that move is only fireball invincible until you do the second mo the second move of that uh, uh, of that two part move. The demon flip on the way up is obviously the invincible part. But as soon as you press a button to do dive kick or throw or whatever, it doesn't. It's not invincible anymore. Good conversion. On the straight hit. Yeah, just throw. Oh. Alright, this could be bad. Well, he got out. He's good hit by him. Oh, I think he tried to do something there. Alright, Chipmunk down, getting a little bit. Oh, that was a lot of damage. What is he? I don't know what he's doing. I don't know what he's doing. Uh, but I have to go play my match now for loser semis.